single game together in 2024 and rotation of the roster is a lot easier when you have multiple players who can play different spots within your system. You yell so much when you're home. He's going to be calm again today on the bench for Columbus. Both teams trying to bounce back from a loss from last week. It's Nashville SC hosting the Columbus crew at Geodis Park. His current teammates as well. This is a chance for Nashville. Wonderful ball for Mukhtar. Positive first touch. Sam Surridge. Big save. Patrick Schulte. Now the first corner of this match for Mukhtar and Nashville. Floated into a dangerous area. And unable to be turned on goal. That was an opportunity for Jack Mayer. Rossi will serve for Columbus. All the way to the back post. Strong header. And in. On the road, the Columbus crew open the scoring. It's Sean Zawatsky. 1-0. And here I am waxing poetic about Nashville and how good they are defending set pieces last year to the back post. You've got some man marking, some zonal marking, but Jacob Schaffelberg on the back post. This is all about winning your mark. And Sean Zawatsky doing fantastic, winning his individual battle, but then a textbook header back post. How about that start from Columbus? But it was before that on the counter from Aiden Morris running into the gaps. That was really good team defending. Now Rossi for Columbus from distance and over. Still looking for his first goal in MLS play this season. It is Jason Russell Rowe getting a chance to lead the line with Rossi and Zawatsky behind him. This is Zawatsky towards Aiden Morris. Oh, the clearance was fluffed. And then Russell Rowe to Penico, who spilled it and gets back on it. With Nashville trailing 1-0. What a chance for Mukhtar. It's over the wall and it's over the goal. But you're coaching players 1 through 28 up. You're improving every single player using the pathways available. Good on you, Wilfred Nancy. Here is Shackleberg. Isolated with Farsi. Gets the cross and Schulte missed it. He'll take it anywhere it goes. Honey Mukhtar breaks his drought. Level the match for Nashville. 1-1. About Patrick Schulte and his ability to come off this line. And he's shown it very well tonight. Except here. But there are 30,000 in this building that could give a rat's you know what. That Patrick Schulte misjudges this because the three time MLS best 11 player gets his first in 2024. And a big one it is. Hani Mukhtar, welcome. It's 1 1. Gary Smith told us he needs just. Here's Mukhtar for Nashville in the final moments of the half turn. Sorry, short, just too far. He leaves it for Schaffelberg. In my opinion, the answer is no. But when this ball is delivered, Sam Surge is off. But because he allows it to play through, you allow play on. And Gary Smith wanted a reaction. He wanted to find out, does this team have the integrity to build off and forget about the worst result in club history last week? Audubon Godoy says, get on my bicycle. Let's go for a ride. It's 2-1. He's bringing on Marino Hinistrosa. For Sean Zawatsky. Zawatsky was Columbus's goal scorer. Also With how that game unfolded. So I think Wilfred Nancy is going to ask his team to be a little bit more direct going forward. They played those vertical balls over the top to cause issues. Uh-oh. Ross oh. is in. He goes down. John Freeman thought about it. Did not give the penalty. I don't think there's any dispute. I think this will take about three seconds. I suppose the only question is, is that inside or outside of the box? Well, it's on top of the white line for sure, in my opinion. So John Freeman has seen it. 
The decision is a penalty for the Columbus Crew. Most likely a yellow card given as well. Rossi versus Panica, who's a bit of a penalty specialist in goal for Nashville. was off his line when the ball was it struck by Diego Rossi. I don't think he was. I think the right foot was there. We saw this throughout all of League's Cup last year that all of a sudden started a conversation. Should Panico be the starting goalkeeper? He changed the formation said, I'm going to play three center backs. You're going to have to go around us, not through us. Here is your boa for Columbus. Darlington Nagby. Nagby curling and Panico going down. He couldn't hold it. It's a corner for Columbus. He's a left back naturally playing at left center back tonight. This is behind for Surridge. Morris defending. Mukhtar in the middle. Surridge goes down. Ends up with Mukhtar. And then just playing. Oh, Patrick Schulte. What a save to keep this two to one. Big ball. Mukhtar will leave it for Schaffelberg. Schaffelberg towards Mukhtar. It's got to Well, he scored maybe the most difficult goal of his career in first half stoppage time. Farsi to Morris to Nagby. Columbus trying to find a way through for an equalizing goal. Yaboa getting around wheel. Yaboa clipping it back post and he strolls it. Textbook header. The technique, the touch. Wow, what a goal that is. Morris getting it down, but it's right to the path of Mokhtar. Mokhtar a couple step overs. Still on him, Mokhtar. Can he get the shot away? It's deflected. And it's held on by Schulte. Nashville SC and Columbus Crew sharing the points 2-2, two two, the final. Marino and Estrosa scoring the equalizing goal for the Columbus crew. His first goal in Columbus, his first in MLS.